Prince Harry told to stand up to Netflix as do quilling hostage to ruthless ridicule. Prince Harry has been urged to stand up to Netflix over the latest season of The Crown and the ruthless depiction of the royal family which has sparked outrage among royal fans across the UK. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle signed a multi-million dollar deal with the streaming giant earlier this year, with the couple taking on production roles. But after Netflix's release of the latest season of The Crown, the Duke of Sussex has been urged to stand up to the company. The call comes from royal author Angela Levin who told talk radio the show had given a ruthless depiction of the royal family and the relationship between Prince Charles and Princess Diana. She warned, they have to think that the royal family is very precious to us. Most of us are very grateful to them and to ridicule them in that ruthless way is appalling. I don't suppose Meghan minds it, it's not her family and she was very unhappy here. But I think Harry has got to stop being a willing hostage and stand up for himself and say I do not want my family treated like this and I am not going to join in if they're going to do that. I can't see Netflix just taking things like unconscious bias and making series of them. I think they'll want the depths of Harry and Meghan's despair. And to pull all that out again is not right. The Crown creator has defended making up scenes for the Netflix drama involving the Prince of Wales and his beloved great-uncle Lord Mountbatten. The fourth season of the much-talked-about series is streaming now and the opening episode features an imagined interaction between the two men. Charles dances Lord Mountbatten admonishes Josh O'Connor's Charles for his pursuit of Camilla, who at the time was married to Andrew Parker Bowles. Viewers see the older man writing a letter warning Charles he is in danger of bringing ruin and disappointment to the family. On the show, the prince only reads the note after the IRA assassinated Lord Mountbatten in August 1979. While no record of the letter exists, Peter Morgan, creator of The Crown, believes the interaction to be based in truth. Speaking on the show's official podcast, he said, what we know is that Mountbatten was really responsible for taking Charles to one side at precisely this point and saying, look, you know, enough already with playing the field, it's time you got married and it's time you provided an heir. As the heir, I think there was some concern that he should settle down, marry the appropriate person and get on with it. Criticism of the Crown has often focused on its portrayal of made-up events. The show employs researchers but Mr. Morgan defended his right to creative freedom.